COVID swept through our nation and life is, at least for the most part, back to normal. Yeah, in 2020, everything changed, though, for the cast of Dear Evan Hansen at Eccles Theater. But now, some of the very same cast members are back. Here's new specialist Katya Stepovic with their story. For some, it feels like a lifetime ago. We were here for two weeks and about a week and a half. <laughs> it was great. For others, it feels like just yesterday that well-known family musical Dear Evan Hansen was bringing tears and smiles to thousands of Utahns at Eccles Theater. And then all of a sudden it was just, you know, taken away. On March 11th, 2020, the curtains closed. It takes a lot for a show to close down. Um, and to know that we were shutting down, we knew something big was going on. Salt Lake County Mayor Jenny Wilson placed a ban on gatherings of 100 or more people. This is a, a very serious time for our state. The same day, the NBA canceled its schedule. Cast members John Hemphill and Colleen Sexton have vivid memories of their emotions that day. We also thought we were going to be back in like two weeks. So it was like, OK, bye, Salt Lake City. We'll see you in a couple weeks. Little did anyone know that was just the start of coronavirus sweeping our nation, halting most things in our lives. We had lost the stage door. We didn't we didn't have that connection with people. And um, so I think, yeah, the fear of certainly health, but the fear of were we going to have theater again? I mean, A show intended to bring connection to humanity went dark. Everything theater stands for stood still and empty with nothing but the unknown in sight. I had all my stuff in storage. You know, I have family at home. I have a mom that was 80 years old and I had no idea where I was going to go. We're all a family out on the road together and to immediately be leaving and lo losing these connections that you rely on day to day was really difficult. Tenacity turned into triumph and three years later the cast is ready to tell you the story of Dear Evan Hansen. This story about the way we live life in this day and age. Because of what happened when it happened um, and our show already has such a message of you know connection the fact that we were all isolated for so long, I think that the message now, being able to come back and do the show now, is so prevalent. Dear Evan Hansen has returned to Salt Lake City and is stronger than ever. The need for theater artists to express and the need for the audience to share is greater than any pandemic or anything that will stand in that, in the way of that. Dear Evan Hansen will play all throughout the weekend and into Sunday. There are still some tickets available. We'll have a link to how you can get them on our website, ksltv.com. For KSL 5 News, I'm Katya Stepovic. Yeah.